Hello and welcome back to Pancake Place Tales from the Borderlands. In the last episode we had to kill Gordas, which is ex extremely emotional, more so than I thought it would be. Uh, Gordas has been the nicest robot and everything it's ever done has always been so kind that... I don't know. I mean, it, it, Loaderbot was a pretty terrible death to go through as well, but Gordas was even worse because it was almost... It was childlike. And then seeing seeing Reese rip out his own oh, his own cybernetics. Wow. These games just really know how to get you. Let's go ahead and see where else it takes us. And that was that. Eventually we made our way back to Hollow Point. Got August patched up. There isn't much more to it. Life sort of returned back to normal. Well, our normal. That was it. You destroyed Gordas, then walked away. Moved on with your life. Like nothing happened. I didn't want to shoot her. I wish there was some other way. What about you? After I came to, I grabbed the rights to Atlas on Pandora from Jack's office. Figured I could use it to build something. A fresh start. At that point, it made sense to head back to the Atlas facility we left. Got it going again. Luckily, it was well stocked. Whole lot of fruit. Fixed myself up. Worked on some prototypes. Obviously, that was all after she ditched me on Helios. I can't believe you thought we left you intentionally. If anyone deserves to have trust issues here, it's me. You had a handsome Jack in your head the entire time and, and waited until you were backed into a corner to tell us. It wasn't like that. Besides, I was afraid you'd freak out if I said anything. Well, we had every right to freak out. You and Jack... You and Jack ruined our lives. Are you serious? That is what you're pissed about? Yes. Well... I came out with a few scars, too. Go on, punk. Quit stalling. Man, put some hustle in it. I, I ain't got all day. I recognize that voice. Kroger? Hey, really? What is this shit? A debt needs to be repaid. What is that supposed to mean? Damn there, fool! Yo, man. You didn't tell me this dude be holed up in a bandit camp. The whole damn place was coming after me. You seem fine. I mean, I lost him, but I wouldn't stick around here too long. Just a matter of time before they come through. I'll take my chances. <sighs> Whatever. Oh, look here. We got Fiona and her corporate chump. The name's Reese, thanks. Look at you, all wrapped up like birthday presents. What are you doing here, Kroger? Last I remember, you couldn't wipe your ass without someone's permission. Man, you just don't stop, do you? here for my own business. Thank you very much. <laughs> Look, I brought you your bandit box. We gonna make the trade or what? Two for one. Can't beat that. Take them. <laughs> no, they ain't making it out of here. This is person. Hey, no, no! Stop! This is the end of the line, girl. No. You, you can't let him do this! So, you got some last words? Just to get him out now. Because you know what they say payback is. Come on, at least make it a fair fight. Mm -mm. I like my odds better this way. This one's for Finch! <laughs> Whoa, whoa, whoa! Gross. Whoa. Whoa. 
Whoa. Whoa. Stop saying that. Don't even think about running. It has to be Vaughn, right? The hell is he doing? This? This is weird. I don't know. Maybe he has a question. He's signaling the bad nets. Oh gosh. <laughs> oh great! A firing squad! I just hit murder bingo! We all know who that is. Don't you recognize the mask? Hey, you, you don't have to do this. try to avoid guns when it comes to conflict resolution. What? What? <laughs> I thought I lost you, buddy. <laughs> Same here, man. I can't believe this. Come on. Aw, he deserves a hug. It's great to see you too, Fiona. We got a lot to catch up on, but it's not entirely safe out here. We'll take you back to the base. Base? Oh yeah. You're not gonna believe what we've done to the place. I mean, the whole thing was nuts! After Valerie beat the ever-living shit out of me, Cassius was nice enough to take me back to his lab and fix me up. Second time that guy saved my ass. I really owe him. The plan was to figure out a way to get you guys from Valerie. Then you left on the rocket, and Valerie opened the vault, and just all hell broke loose. I tried to find you guys, but eventually I started suspecting the worst. I didn't want to think that way, but, but, after a while, it's just hard not to lose hope. Honestly, <laughs> I'm just happy you're safe. Same here, man. The whole thing was so surreal, you know? I mean, Helios crashing. But by the time the dust settled, everyone was gone. Except for the ones that made it to the escape pods. I managed to find a vet. She got out, thanks to you. She's back at the base. Never expect to be leading a bunch of Hyperion refugees. I mean, they were crawling out of those things like newborns, just bleary eyed and scared. Their first day on Pandora. I'm kind of surprised you helped them. Really? Why? I just figured you were done with Hyperion. They're not Hyperion anymore. I mean, most of these people. They hadn't spent a waking hour doing anything but just sitting on their ass, getting sweatier and fatter. 
which is why we decided to make our base out of what was left of Helios. Cool, right? Whoa. Okay. Yeah, they're pretty deferential, which is really odd for a bunch of ex-Hyperion. Hello! Wow, they must really revere you. <laughs> oh, that's not for me. They're bowing to you. What, me? But this isn't for you? <laughs> You're kidding me. I wish I was. Look, they even have a shrine for them. Um... <laughs> That, that, that's a statue of Jack. Yes, very observant it was, at one point, but uh, they went ahead and labeled it Reese. Very efficient. Someone tried to alter the face to look like you, but um, most of these guys are basically shitty at everything. Finally, some respect. Oh, shut up. What? <laughs> I get no respect. Reese, you don't understand. To them, you are the great liberator. You see, you crashing Helios shed them of their corporate shackles. All right, then. Let's take advantage of my fame. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> wow. <laughs> My forehead isn't really that big. <laughs> is it? <laughs> yes, it is actually. You're just jealous because they're not drawing pictures of you. You're right, Reese. You got me. I told you, they're sucky. Kill it with fire. <laughs> Will you two quit goofing off already? Will you relax? Come on, get me some drake fruit. Drake fruit. Drake fruit's delicious. <laughs> You're not even a little curious to hear what this guy has to say? I mean, yeah, but there's fruit. I'm talking to him. Okay, okay, okay. I'm coming. <laughs> uh, Have fun. I've got some work to do. I'm doing the talking. Okay, I'll be the backup muscle. Why? Well, I, I got a gun. Okay, cool. Then Fiona, you're a backup, and I'll be good cop. Yeah, okay. I can do that. We got answers and we want some questions. You listen, buddy. You make sure to answer. Hey! No more games, asshole! Why'd you kidnap us? To learn the truth. Enough of the haiku bullshit. You give us straight answers when we ask you a question. You're supposed to be good, cop. Are you sure? Or else one of us, just slightly unclear which one, is gonna have to get mean. I saw people wearing those suits on the base. That means you were on Helios. Or at least around the crash site. Look, you obviously know us. You wouldn't be doing this if you didn't. So just, no more games. I do know you. Better now than I ever have. I was there. I was there when Gordas was destroyed. I 
I saw the betrayal. I saw it, but I could not believe it. I had asked for only one thing. <gasps> After giving so much, I had sacrificed everything for my friends. Only to be betrayed. Oh my god. You asked earlier, why did I do this? The answer is simple. To bring my friends together. All of them. What about Bye. Yeah, hi. Uh, I have a lot of questions. <laughs> you and me both. I don't understand. I didn't either. I went back to Helios. I needed to survive. To find you. To learn the truth. Motorbot. But why the disguise? I mean, why the secrecy? Huh? Why, why not just tell us? I was afraid if you knew who I was, you would lie about what happened. It is in your nature to lie. He's got a point there. Right, Hyperion guy, con artist. It checks out. I really am sorry about Gordas. I didn't have a choice. I know that now. I am sorry for not trusting you. Please forgive me. Oh, come on. How can you be mad at that face? <laughs> that is a face, right? I'm sorry, too. No need. You had your reasons. Aww. Okay, so obviously I'm excited to see Loaderbot too, but it doesn't explain why you got us all together. I mean, I assume that's why you had me captured by that Kroger guy? Yes. Follow me. I brought you together to help me assemble Gordas and summon the Vault of the Traveler. What? Whoa. Yeah. Heavy. Have you forgotten about the vault monster that nearly killed us? This time, it will be different. How? We will all be there to fight it. With some friends. We were unprepared. Weak. That won't be the case this time. That's not much of a plan. Not that I'm saying no. I have faith. We can find a way. You mentioned friends. What do you mean by that? I've compiled a list of people who may be willing to help us. The last few months were spent tracking their locations. We'll need help to take that thing down. Killing the Vault Monster is the only way to ensure that Gortus can live in peace. The only way to save her. Whatever help the Children of Helios can provide is at your service. Thank you. I don't have an army of former Hyperion weirdos. But I owe you my life. You would have done the same for me. Count me in. For Gordas. And as a bonus, the treasure in that vault. Well, the endless riches is what usually motivates people. <laughs> you are the best. So, you, me, LB, Bond's on board. Hell yeah, he is. I can get Sasha here. Oh, uh, so she's, uh... How many more we need? Vault Hunter teams are most effective in groups of four. Two teams would optimize our chances of success. Okay, so we need three more members. Loaderbot, any suggestions? It's all you. Oh, 
okay? No pressure? Just give me a second to think. Who's stopping you? I'm a visual thinker. Yeah, I don't know what that means. I, I know the words that you just said, but not together like that. She achieves clarity through visualization. Oh, oh, okay, well, you know, why didn't you just say that? Athena, definitely. Oh, what's that mean? Oh. Uh. I found someone new. He's experienced, but it looks like he's more than we can afford. No, oh, was it? No point in saying. You'd just be disappointed. No. Uh. Oh. <gasps> Felix? Okay, Athena definitely. Who's this? Zero? Oh. No. No. <gasps> yes! You told Springs that Athena loved her. Oh, she is grateful that you helped save her relationship. Oh, yes! I'll take her. <laughs> Mental baggage, six out of six suitcases. <laughs> Actually. We're going to be picking our team in the next video. I will see you next time. This has been Pancake Plays Tales from the Borderlands.